हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू दिस चैनल स्टैटिस्टिक्स फॉर ऑल ई लर्निंग एनी टाइम एनी वेयर प्लीज लाइक सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर ऑल्सो प्रेस बेल आइकन थैंक यू इलेस्ट्रेशन एनालिस ऑफ वेरियंस एनोवा वन वे क्लासिफिकेशन स्टार्ट यो सेल्समैन सेल्समैन वन सेल्समैन टू सेल्समैन थ्री locality wise sales record of salesmen locality 1 locality 2 locality 3 locality 4 data information is given here salesman 1 5 563 salesman 2 4 668 salesman 3 8759 now test the significance of the difference of the three salesmen using one way classification analysis of variance anova now let's start solution null hypothesis that is h0 There is no significant difference between the three salesmen. Here we put the same data here. Last column added total, and in row total is added here. So we have the total of five five six three row wise. That is equal to nineteen. Salesman one, salesman two, four six six eight. Total we get twenty four. Salesman three. Eight seven five nine. We get the total twenty nine. So now sum of this total nineteen plus twenty four plus twenty nine. We get capital T that is equal to seventy two. Now here capital N is equal to twelve. That is row into column. There are four column and three rows. That capital N is equal to twelve. K is equal to four. K is what your column one locality one. Locality two, locality three, locality four. That is k is equal to four. H is your row. That is row is how much? H is equal to three. Salesman one, salesman two, salesman three. That is h is equal to three. Now, finding sum of square for all the values. That is five square plus five square plus six square. Plus three square, plus four square, plus six squares, plus six square, plus eight square, plus eight square, plus seven squares, plus five squares. Plus nine squares. After finding the square, we do the sum. We get the total value that is equal to four sixty six. Now, correction factor that is equal to t square divided by n. Your correction factor that is t is equal to seventy two to seventy two square divided by n n is equal to twelve so seventy two square is equal to five thousand one hundred and eighty four divided by twelve we get the value correction factor four thirty two so you can see that now we'll find total sum of squares so your Total sum of square that is four sixty six minus four thirty two. This is total sum of squares. So we get the value thirty four four sixty six minus four thirty two that is equal to thirty four. Now this is the ANOVA table sources of variations between classes within classes in total. In column degrees of freedom, sum of square, mean sum of square, and f value. So total sum of square we put the value thirty four. Now sum of square of three different salesmen. That is nineteen square plus twenty four squares plus twenty nine squares. So here we get the value three sixty one plus four six five six five seventy six plus four 
plus 841. So we get the value 1778. So now we will find sum of square of between classes that is SSC that is equal to summation T A square divided by K minus correction factor. So SSC is equal to sum of T square we get the value 1778 divided by K. K is equal to how much? 4 minus 432 that is what correction factor so we get the value 444.5 minus 432 so that is equal to 12.5 we put in the ANOVA table between classes 12.5 SSC now after finding this we will find sum of square of within classes that is SSC that is equal to TSS minus SSC so your SSC is equal to total sum of square 34 minus 12.5 that is we will get 21.5 now total degrees of freedom capital N minus 1 that is equal to 12 minus 1 that is 11 so that is we get the value 11 degrees of freedom for between classes that is H minus 1, that is 3 minus 1, that is equal to 2. Now, within classes, degrees of freedom for within classes, that is a capital N minus H, that is 12 minus 3, that is equal to 9. So, we put the value here, 9, within classes. Now, we will find mean sum of square between classes. So 12.5 divided by 2 that is sum of square between classes divided by degrees of freedom. So 12.5 divided by degrees of freedom we get the value 6.25. So now putting this value in the ANOVA table. Now we will find mean of sum of square within classes that is sum of square within classes divided by degrees of freedom of within classes. So your 21.5 divided by 9. So we get value 2.39. Now putting this value in the in our table. Now after finding this F calculated value. So 6.25 and 2.39 so 6.25 is greater than 2.39 so we'll yeah F calculated value will be 6.25 divided by 2.39 we get the value 2.62 so your yeah, F calculated value is 2.62 now finding table value of F at alpha is equal to 0 0.05 so your v1 is equal to how much 2 and v2 is equal to 9 so your we can see from the table 2 v1 and v2 is equal to 9 so we get the value 4.25 6 so F table value 4.2526 F calculated value 2.62 so here 2.62 is less than 4.26 so F calculated is less than F table value so therefore null hypothesis can be accepted hence there is no significant difference between the three sales man any doubt please write in comment section for practice again just given salesman salesman 1 salesman 2 salesman 3 locality by sales record of salesman locality 1 locality 2 locality 3 locality 4 data information is given here 8896 7991 uh, 7911 11, 10, 8, 12.
test the significance of the difference of the three salesmen using one way classification analysis of variance ANOVA. Please like this video, subscribe this channel, statistics for all, share this video and thanks for watching this video.